Hey guys, I'm Anna from Z Digitizing. In this video, I will be sharing with you how to convert an embroidery file by using an embroidery software called Wilcom True Sizer. Wilcom True Sizer is an online tool that offers you various stunning and useful options that you can utilize for your embroidery project. And the best thing about making use of this tool is that you don't have to install it on your desktop as a regular embroidery application. And one of the worth mentioning things about Welcome True Sizer is that you can convert embroidery to your desired file type for free. Changing your embroidery from one format type to another involves really easy steps. So let's get started. Before we continue guys, please make sure to subscribe to this channel for any upcoming videos. Step 1. Visit the official site of Wilcom True Sizer web, and there you will be asked to log into your account. Create one if you do not have it already. Link mentioned in the description. Step 2. Once you have successfully logged into your account, it will load the interface of your web application. Click on Open Design on the top left corner. It should open up a dialog box for you and will let you select your file, either from the SkyDrive or from your computer storage. Browse your design file and select OK. Wait for a moment till it loads up your embroidery design file. Step 3. Before you convert it to another file, just reassure yourself that if you want it the same, if not, then just make some quick changes which are required. Step 4. After having a bird's eye view on your finalized project, click on the Save Result button from the left window. It will further give you three options, and we have to go for Convert Design. Step 5. Once you click on the Convert Design button, it will open up a dialog box option asking where to save your design. Choose between SkyDrive and Computer Storage. Note. Convert Design to Option is equivalent to Save as Option. Step 6. After selecting your primary storage option, click on the drop-down menu. Make sure to select your required file format according to your embroidery machine. After selecting it, click on the Save button. You can rename it if you want. You have successfully changed your file type to the different file format for free. Wait, just hold on before we reach the end. If you are looking for converting an image to an embroidery file, then head over to Z Digitizing because this tool cannot convert an image to the embroidery file. Hope it will be helpful for you guys. If there's any question related to this video, you can simply ask in the comment section. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. And finally, thanks for watching!